Okay. <clears throat> uh, our orientation to real-time economy uh, uh, last year was to establish uh, some building blocks from uh, CEF, uh, from Brussels, from European Union. And there is like a report based on it. So, uh, like you ask, at general real-time economy. Uh, it, it is a very good idea. It's uh, a new idea from uh, uh, Estonia on, on maybe Finland last year. And we would like to share as much as possible uh, such kind of, of, of um, artifact like real-time economy. And uh, now we are talking with the um, uh, Ministry of Economy and Innovation to establish uh, some stable, uh, maybe committee or working group or, or some department of real-time economy. So uh, general RTE is under development right now. Uh, what subjects we are like most important, it's invoicing, ECMR, and e receipt, like, uh, like uh, 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 plans of uh, Nordic Baltic countries under the Gina project. So, uh, invoicing. Uh, uh, invoicing platform started uh, five years ago like uh, like uh, st uh, state enterprise uh, center or, uh, service of center of registers uh, and um, uh, now we have last year established two access points of PEPL invoicing uh, e-delivery uh, uh, infrastructure and uh, uh, two years ago, invoicing covered about 60% of e-procurement contracts. Uh, I say the delivery access points are ready and uh, are used for daily use. So what is new, what is very new? Um, uh, last summer, uh, our government decided to approve plan for the DNA of the future economy. It was like a response of our government uh, to the uh, COVID crisis. And uh, this plan uh, just have assigned about 6 billion of euro. Uh, what is very important for us uh, to digital economy and business is is assigned about 1 billion and uh, 3 uh, maybe 4 uh, million euro what is uh, very important that uh, uh, under under our researches uh, about uh, our market and uh, uh, some problems with invoicing, we found that uh, uh, main problem is the lack of last mile solution. And uh, we had some, uh, we, that's mean uh, association in uh, with companies. Um, we had planned to make some open source uh, last mile connector. Uh, uh, such kind of connector is between access point and uh, uh, ERP of uh, every company. Uh, we found that uh, there is uh, maybe 50 uh, ERP producers in the country. And uh, we proposed to government to uh, support uh, uh, establishing of uh, such uh, connector and to make uh, available at uh, open source uh, uh, for free for, for every company. Uh, so uh, this plan uh, will be will be financed by uh, plan for uh, DNA in the future economy. 
Uh, that means that uh, in next year we should we should have maybe uh, such kind of connector and uh, invoicing will go to the B2B sector. So <clears throat> uh, it's about yes uh, building blocks uh, yes what we found that uh, uh, under wor work program of CEF Telecom we found blockchain uh, blockchain uh, program and uh, we participate in it and uh, we suppose that blockchain will be used in our uh, CMR eCMR uh, project uh, for 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 cross-border uh, usage. Also, what is very good that uh, our national bank started sandbox for blockchain and we participated in, in, in it and uh, established some may, maybe startup uh, projects. So, uh, what another? Oh. So, oh, the ah, uh, also we talked about e receipt. Uh, no, no actual news because we have uh, some postponed uh, tenders for uh, our e receipt project of uh, of of of, of um, our authorities. But it it, it is a good uh, opportunity to mm, redesign our architecture of e receipt uh, because we plan to use uh, e delivery to use um, uh, 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 before it was decided that e receipt is like e invoice. That means we could use invoice infrastructure for e receipt. Yes, and uh, I said uh, we will use e-delivery and also we plan to use for addressing EIDAS infrastructure and also we would plan to uh, will will plan to use blockchain for transport. So that's all. Thank you. Maybe you have some questions. Thank you. Uh, no questions from the chat, but I remember there was one question from Maria regarding the, the project, uh, e-receipt project uh, in uh, Lithuania. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Yes, it was uh, idea of our tax authority uh, two years ago uh, to make uh, electronic cashier uh, to change uh, our fiscal cashiers in the market to some electronic cashiers. And under it uh, was was made some some plan how it will be done and uh, after there, would, there was uh, tenders of our tax authorities but uh, the tender uh, was postponed because of some some misunderstanding between <coughs> between uh, market players and uh, so on what details you are interested in well, I'm happy with this, but you know, any further questions from Maria? I can ask her because she's here. <laughs> yes. The, the benefits. Yeah, it's the benefits of physical communication. I can see her, and I can see that she's happy now. <laughs> <laughs> Th thank you, Virginius. Uh, thank you.